corner with about eight minutes left in the flow of up and down dunks, cherry picking, let you, if you get a step, you get your dunk. And Kobe got a step on Dwayne Wade, and all of a sudden he gets wrapped up from behind when he thought he had a free dunk. And not only wrapped up, Dwayne reaches up and rakes him across the bridge of the nose and breaks his nose and forces Kobe to wear a mask last night. He had a concussion syndrome. Do you, you think Kobe loved that? Do you think he doesn't have any issue with Dwayne Wade? It's, as friendly as they might be, I think he still has an issue. He doesn't have an issue with it because he knows it was not intentional because he knows that Dwayne Wade is not that kind of player. That's number one. Number two, and more importantly, since you brought up the fact that I was sitting across from you and, and questioning my objectivity. How do you, you, you know it wasn't Rob Parker? You don't I'm live in about. subjectivity every single day. The reality is, is that nobody kisses Dwayne Wade's tush more than you. I you agree. love the guy. You That's rave about point. the guy. You don't just I Don't interrupt me. I'm talking. The point is, you sit there and you talk about Dwayne Wade, and you sit there and talk about how great he is, what a professional he is, what a champion he is. So there is nothing about what transpired in terms of what you're describing it to be that it remotely comes associated with the Dwayne Wade you have known and loved for all of these years. So one play ultimately makes you say, oh, you think it was a cheap shot? I have never seen Dwayne Wade issue a cheap shot in his career, okay? And I don't think he applies out. in an all-star game. I made the mistake yesterday of saying that Dwayne Wade has nothing on his rap sheet as far as dirty play, cheap shots. And the Celtic fans via Twitter yesterday were all over me reminding me I'll of game down. three in last year's playoffs when I got to admit it. I'm not sure he it was intentional, it didn't look intentional to me, but Dwayne Wade does drag down Rondo. This is game three, Celtics are up, and Rondo had no choice but to brace with his left arm, and he dislocated his left elbow, which then cost the Celtics any prayer of making that a series, which the Can we he, talk basketball? I, I just Can we talk basketball? to you. I just explained it to you. you. Evidently you're not. You're evidently you're not, because what I'm trying to say to you is this. Just because you're physical, doesn't mean you're intentionally trying to hurt somebody. That's the difference, that's the distinction that needs to be made here. Dwayne Wade is not somebody that would intentionally try to hurt somebody, and Kobe Bryant knows it, just like Rajon Rondo knows it. That's the reality. Even if he did drag Rajon Rondo down, okay, and ultimately force his elbow to be out of whack, that's not what his intent was. Next topic, gentlemen. Lynn and Mello click for a win. The New York Knicks.